My name is Kent Honda, a typical college student. I have no friends, so my college life is not interesting at all. My everyday life isn't that bad, even though I want to have some excitement once in a while. Ouch! Ouch! How could he run away without saying sorry? He's got no common sense. He's a thief! Someone stop him! A thief? No wonder he's got no common sense. Okay, here I come. I was in the track and field club in both middle and high school, so I must be faster than him. I can probably catch up to him. Got you. Hey, get off. Never. Th thank you so much. No worries. Is this your bag? Yes, you've been a big help. The thief was arrested by the police. He was a serial purse snatcher who's evaded the police several times. After some questioning, the girl and I were released. Honda-san, thank you so much. No worries, Toyota-san. I just did what I had to. Um, do you want to get some coffee? I really want to take you out. Just my way of saying thank you. She doesn't need to, but she'll insist if I say no. Sure. Thank you. Great, but don't you have any plans? I have nothing to do, so I'm fine. I actually have to go to class, but oh well. It's on me, so please order anything you like. Uh, okay. Thank you. What is this place? It's too fashionable for a nerd like me. A cup of tea costs over a thousand yen. This is definitely not the place for me. And this girl, she's got an overwhelming presence. Her beauty can't be hidden with glasses and a mask. What's wrong? Nothing. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll take off my mask and glasses. Uh, are, are you? So, you know who I am. Yes, I am Mary Toyota. Are you really? Is she really that Mary Toyota? Is she really Mary Toyota, the famous actress? <laughs> You're making me embarrassed. Oops. Uh, sorry. I won't look at you anymore. Uh, that's sad as well. This is too extraordinary. Sure, I want to have some excitement, but this is too much. More than what I'd expected. Honda-san, you're really a fast runner. I was in the track and field club when I was in school. That's great. I'm a slow runner. A slow runner can be cute, just like mascots. <laughs> I'm not that slow. Talking with her is easier than I thought. She isn't that different from what I've seen on TV, so maybe that's why. A waitress brings us cups of tea. It's not only expensive, but a premium that Mari Toyota paid for me. What? what are you doing? It might bring me good luck. I'm not God or something, you know? <laughs> on the sun, you're really funny. Really? It's the first time someone said that about me. What? People around you don't know who you really are. Well, actually, I don't have any friends in college. Really? Yeah, I'm just a nerd who could run fast. Don't talk like that about yourself. Then do you want to be my friend? Uh, are you sure? Of course! I think you're really great, apart from the fact that you saved me. You... Think I'm great? Well, yes, I think you are. Then where do you want to go on our honeymoon? Y you're leaping too much. Oops, sorry. I've been alone for so long, so I don't know how to act before a friend. <laughs> That's okay. And let's stop being formal and polite. Sure, Maddie. Uh, you're too quick. <sighs> it's been a while since I had such a great time. What about your work? Isn't it fun? It's fun, but I have to care about a lot of things even though I'm still young. So I really need some time to relax and have fun like this. Yep, you seem very busy. Yeah, I'm thankful for the work I have. But I have a lot of free time when I don't have shoots just like today. So, will you meet with me again? Of course. I'll drop out of college if I have to. You have to go to your classes. Okay. And so we exchanged our numbers. 
She sent me a message to let me know when she's going to be available right after we parted. So I guess she really meant that she wanted us to be friends. I texted her back and we promised to meet next week. I felt that we became closer with every message, and my usual days became more interesting and meaningful. And so the day we promised to meet each other finally came. Gun, thanks for agreeing to come to karaoke. No problem. But do you like karaoke? Uh, yes, but... But? I don't want to get photographed by paparazzi, you know. So that really happens then? Yeah, I don't want people to know about my private life. Are you not allowed to have a boyfriend? I'm not sure. I'm not a child anymore, and my agency didn't say anything about it, but... Would you be disappointed if my agency says that I'm not allowed to have a boyfriend? Yes, because we won't be able to go on our honeymoon. Honeymoon? Ugh, Cancun, that's embarrassing! Huh? Why? Anyways, let's sing. Uh, sure. <sighs> what did you think? You're really good! Huh? No, I'm not. I can't sing anymore. God won't allow me to sing after hearing you sing. I want to hear you sing too! Well, I'll need a year or so to get ready. <laughs> okay then, let's just talk. Oh. Yes? Really? What's wrong? Well, I just realized that we're all alone in this room. Yeah, I guess we are. Don't you get nervous? Nervous? Why? Friends go to karaoke all the time, right? Y yeah but you know... Uh, I get it! You've been alone for so long that you don't get this kind of feeling! What are you talking about? You know, there was another reason why I wanted to come here today. Huh? I, I can get close to you while singing. Wait, I think I know what you're trying to tell me. Yeah, because I'm making it very clear. But why? I'm an actress, you know, so eventually, I'll have to kiss somebody in a play. Yeah. I don't mind because it's my job, but I want to have my first kiss with someone I like. So, if you don't mind, then... Uh, of course I, I don't mind. <laughs> Great, then... And so we became a couple. We might face a lot of troubles with her being a popular actress and me a nobody, but I'm sure we'll be fine. Thank you for watching again! It would make me so happy if we could watch another rom-com story together. Also, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. See you next time! Bye!